I wanted to make a video about carrier waves and their significance um, with Rife machines because Royal Raymond Rife used a carrier wave signal and what a carrier wave signal did was it oscillated quite a bit um, between frequencies you know inputted so yeah I've got this turned uh, the time base control is way down um, five microseconds here it wasn't one microsecond just so I can show rise time and this is on my skin um, and these highest peaks here these are the fundamental frequencies or you know this 89,298 Hertz uh, that I put into the machine and in between each you see a lot of peaks and valleys those peaks and valleys with Rice's machine, as I understand it, were produced by an alternate signal generator. So they're they're going to be constant. Uh, maybe 10 is looking a little bit too fast. Yes, yeah, so this is you know on my skin again, and you know you're not seeing an electromagnetic effect uh, here. If I take it right next right next to it, you'll get it. Um, but it looks different when it hits my skin, doesn't it? Um, you know, you get one, and then, you know, how many ever peaks there are, there's multiples of that, uh, included. Um, so when you're running one frequency, especially with a square wave or something, you're going to get a much higher rate. Uh, there's some inaccuracies from the frequency measurement there. But... You know, when these all look the same, it's the same frequency being run. When this peak is the same as this peak, is the same as the other peak, that's the frequency. Um, if I slide it around my hand, it's going to be different as well. Uh, the reason this pulse technology doesn't need to rely on the substitute uh, carrier wave frequencies is because the carrier wave is produced through harmonics and is uh, unique to each frequency uh, given so I don't need to switch between two or three because I've got the exact because it's derived from the harmonics of the original frequency um, and I'm not having to pick between you know one that's close I can do one that's the exact um, I think that's really important and a lot of people studying Rife you know they've they've gotten to that point and they're like well where's the carrier wave um, some of the carrier waves from devices, they are, well, I believe, uh, 100,000 hertz, I think, on the BCX Ultra. Someone correct me if I'm if I'm wrong there. Um, some of these carrier rates are just, they're really low. Um, they're not in the megahertz range. Um, it depends on what time base controls and what frequency I'm running uh, to what the, the ultimate is going to be. change that to one you see it's showing a different frequency um, these time-based controls are also pretty interesting because if you're not switching on and off at least um, within this 20 microseconds and you can't enter the cells whatsoever um, that's why this is very important so, that's that I think, um, and it's just the organ support frequencies, which are freely available. Feel free to copy those down. Try to run them with your machine. Um, these are meant for the liver and kidneys uh, specifically. You see, it's not an electromagnetic effect. Scalar, as soon as I touch it, um, the electricity is, you know, it's here. It's also here. Note the peaks are the same. Yeah, yeah. You see the, the value of the harmonics because you know what might destroy the microorganism could be much higher than the numbers uh, that are being run or put into the machines. Um, 
And if you run uh, sine wave, I'll try to find like, some solfeg geo stuff. I can just switch all these. 396, okay. This is 396 hertz. I'll have to change these time controls because it's a much slower frequency. Well, apparently much, much slower. You see just a peak coming around every now and then. Fifty. Come on, show me a couple of these damn things. Together. Not triggered. This is one of the reasons these Solfagio ones should be run uh, through contact. I'll try to take some of these harmonics away by changing the waveform. Um, this is an arbitrary waveform generator, so waveforms can be patterned for it. Alright, it's barely, barely on here. What do you think? Still a great deal of harmonics. Uh, I can't seem to get these out of here. Just run something familiar with everyone, you know, change it to a sine wave. You're still going to get a ton of harmonics because you're running it with a plasma. Um, running it with the contact, it's a totally different story. Anyways, uh, that's why this thing doesn't have carrier waves, because it doesn't need them. It's got plenty of harmonics on its own.